and what is going on YouTube? Just another gaming channel, bring you just another video. So here we are guys, uh, multiplayer, no, excuse me, Call of Duty Infinite Warfare now, some of you have seen over 100 Black Ops 3 videos and before that I played, well apart from Advanced Warfare, I only played for a few months, I really didn't like that game, but you know I've played like 12 hours a day on most Call of Duties for years. Um, but I've, I've gone off Call of Duty now, um, but I'm interested in this campaign. This is this is my sort of thing, you see. So, you know, I love sci-fi, you know, where the human race might end up going. So I thought we'd uh, do a let's play or a run through of the campaign. So here we go. So we're going to go for a new game. Continue. We'll just do it on regular, no problem. There's two settings after that. The sun, the moon, and the stars would have disappeared long ago. And they happen to be in the reach of predatory human hands. That's true. The needs of our planet were greater than she could supply. So we went beyond the reaches of our atmosphere. That's what you call intro. The new frontier offered the promise of a new beginning. But the distance gave way to a movement with no connection to the place we call home. New rules, new ambitions, a new enemy. The settlement defense front built an army and broke away from the earth with blood and violence. They aren't revolutionaries. They want absolute power. They raid colonies take resources and control territories by force. They use their fleet to block God. us from raw materials we need to survive. Their mission is to erase everything Earthborn. Today the SDF is a war machine, ruled by its military. If a leader united oh, shit. that force, they would mobilize. Try to take our homeland. Holy crap. It's gonna be as one day, guys. War, this is Scar 1. Standing by for tasking. Copy 1 1. One of our weapons facilities is under attack by the SDN. Beautiful. I believe this is part of an operation codenamed Raya. Intel suggests their target is a prototype weapon. Your team will extract the prototype. And torch the site before SDF can locate it. Understood, Warlord. We'll get it done. One minute! Friendlies! Facility's dark. We get our weapon, torch the site. Gear check! OMA systems online. Rules of engagement. Weapons free. Good to go. Ten seconds. Let's go! Go! Go, go! That's perfect. Stay tight! Holy oh, shit. This is awesome. Oh! Damn! So, oh my god, look at that, guys. <gasps> Holy shit. This guy's a boots on the ground. Copy, one one. Insert is a vertical drop north of your position. Gopi, on the move. Oh my god, I've got chills. Look at this, Europa. We're, we're planning on visiting this in real life. They think there's a good chance there might be actual life. There's an ocean under the ice. Oh no, we're not swimming, are we? Oh shit. Son. So I've stake point. One one to Reaper. Set their gunners in the AO. Troops in contact. Copy, we'll relay. Uh, not to use. Let's get to the weapon before they do. Alright, let's, let's do it. Oh, 
that slide's nice. Damn it, I'm, I'm scared I might start playing multiplayer. It feels, oh, it feels nice. He's down. It you take a shot, damn it. Dead ahead. Keep moving. Reaper, we're approaching the entry point. Be advised, we've encountered steady SDF presence. They're on a spotty in your depths, so stay alert. Stand fast. Sentry's on the roof. Wolf, take one, we got the others. Feels beautiful. Oh shit. Oh shit. Bit embarrassing for dodge straight away. Oh crap. They just executed them. the Air Force weapons, no prisoners. Man, when we got on when we first landed that scene with Jupiter and it that another moon, oh my god, it's beautiful. Take his ass. Copy that. Oh shit, what? Oh, wow. Go. Nice. Right clear. Man out. Our weapons in the armory vault. Half a click up. Close quarters. Check your scopes. Okay. Okay, I get you. How about this. Okay. No. So I've got you more resume there. Assume they did. Let's give them a proper welcome then. Oh, okay, that's cool. Wait, sight flips down. Doesn't anti grab. Copy that. What's up, sir? They're down. So I need to get rid of that. He's down. Watch your corners. It's a nice setting, isn't it, guys? I love this sci fi shit. Don't know why so many people hate it. Moving to the armory. Copy. Be advised. SDF is almost inside. Operation Riot cannot succeed. Once the weapon is secure, I can activate the self destruct sequence. Copy. Eyes on research lab. Seems like a lot of work's gone into this, doesn't it, fellas? Contact. Now, exfil in six mics. Out. Weapons on the other side. We beat them to it. Sights are crashing. So this is like... Clear. Oh, that's some Jackpot. Shit. Got eyes on the ball. Rupert, we're inside the armory. Moving to secure the weapon. Well, you know one of those big things is going to come out, don't you? Weapons behind those doors. Full on seekers. I've got Titanfall 2 to play for this, I've got Darksiders 2. Left spark on the time. up sights. We're gonna need it. Damn. Here, Wolf, compact model, same tech. The riot operation, we're after this. Oh shit. Reaper, weapon secure. Confirming execute order and self-destruct. Roger, initiating self-destruct sequence. You know one of those walkers is gonna come through. You need to get out of there now. Copy, we're Oscar Mike, yeah. RV in five. Clock's ticking, let's move! Attention, self-destruct active. All personnel must clear the area. Okay. So I'm just 
guy. Guessing this thing can damage it. Wicked opening campaign. Oh damn, this is a wicked opening mission for the campaign. Really good. Really impressed. Stop transmitting. It's been 18 hours, no contact. Set def's made no demands. Settlement Defense Front doesn't make demands. They planted a flag in our rock. They executed three men and shot down a pilot. Our team was sent to secure classified weapons from a closed facility. That facility is a black site, Admiral. Why the hell is Set Def allowed in that airspace? By permission of the Accords, all nations have access to Sir, free. Sir, that objective required a full strike force, not a four man team. Lieutenant Reyes. I implore you to use diplomacy in this office. Take a different tact. Yes, sir. Who else knows about this? Right now, Joint Strategic Air Command and you. 
This is a deliberate act of aggression, Admiral. We should be out there on patrol, not down here throwing confetti. The rules of engagement prohibit definitive action under these circumstances. So we stand by with our barrels in the sand and we watch a Fleet Week parade? Lieutenant Reyes, make no mistake. My instincts, which are aligned indelibly with your own, are that we need to engage. Why don't we, sir? <sighs> They're politicians, Reyes. They'll wipe hell's ass with whatever flag keeps the smokestacks burning. To these men, the idea of mounting nice graphics, an offensive guys. a fresh and unplanned peace. Sorry I'm being quiet, I wanna let you hear the campaign. Until it's war, the warriors aren't in charge. But sir, by the time there's war, it's too late. Hesitation is a hole in the head. You drilled that into us relentlessly in flight school. Work the problem, respond. You are always a fast learner, Lieutenant. STRATCOM is well aware of our grievances. At this time, no use of force is being considered on an operational level. These are the laws of war, son. Thank you for the briefing, sir. Admiral Raines, E3N is in position on the roof. Thank you, Petty Officer. What is E3N? Go take a look for yourself. I think you'll be quite impressed. Dismissed. How many? Four. KIA. Europa? Front was already there. Took out the whole team. Looted the site. Son of a bitch. This full each stuff is nonsense. We should be up in our jackals flying watch. Admiral doesn't disagree. Captain Alderno? Negative. Today, retribution isn't a warship, it's a parade float. Whole fleet here in Geneva? Doesn't seem right. We do this every year, Saul. Well, let's not miss the party. After you, Lieutenant. Thanks, Slick. I like long campaigns with cutscenes. Come on. Like cut scenes. We'll take the scenic route. Yes, ma'am. So all the fleets, Earth fleet's gonna gather in Geneva and to do the parade. Not a list you wanna make. And I'm guessing that's when Mars is gonna attack. Fallen. Wheels, guys, we can get off our own asses. Okay, is that not here? Am I supposed to be down here? There she is. Retribution. Oh, okay, yeah. Home sweet home. It's only been down here a day, so. I prefer the wild black yonder. You and me both. Reigns mentioned a thing called E3N. Heard of it? Negative. Gray man's got all kinds of tricks up those four-star sleeves. He's flying to the ceremony with us. Make sure you don't call him that. Never. To his face. Make a hole. Right this way, Lieutenant. The service has its perks. We got a plane to catch. today, Reyes. That's an order. You can't give me an order. We're the same rank. You got me there, Lieutenant. I think this is where the sh the, our own weapons attack the ships from what I saw at the campaign. Lieutenant Reyes. What the hell is that? I think we found E3N. Indeed, sir. Petty Officer First Class E3N. It has tactical humanoid. Third revision. That's a mouthful. You ain't kidding. Call me Ethan, ma'am. What are your orders? I'm assigned to retribution, reporting to Captain Alder. Program for combat? Thoroughly, ma'am. Born to kill. You look like you can kick some serious <laughs> ass. Well, now you're just making me blush, sir. Step aside, Ethan. This old goat can still climb. Welcome aboard, Admiral. Well, now that we're all acquainted, let's 
Let's get up and away. Roger, I'm on. My robot's got a good personality, so I say. Kept the Ethan project well under the radar, Admiral. Captain Alder knew. First troop ready model. Quite remarkable. We're revealing him at the ceremony today. You know I got stage fright, right, sir? You got feelings, <laughs> Ethan? I do, Lieutenant. I do. I carry the brain of a human farmer. Holy shit, are you serious? No, ma'am. Not at all. <laughs> you got you, Lieutenant. Did not. <laughs> Aegis guns are working overtime today, huh, Admiral? A lot of Allied traffic. Always vigilant, Lieutenant. You familiar with the air intercept systems, Ethan? Earth's Iron Shield. Major firepower. Vengeance, this is Raven 6. We're on final approach. Copy 6. Vengeance is awaiting your arrival. Admiral, sir. What is it, Ethan? The Aegis guns. They appear to be tracking our fleet. Incoming! Oh, shit. I think we'll leave it there guys, we'll leave it till the next checkpoint loads up. Or oh, the cut cutscene ends. I'm alright. Shoot down the fleet. We have to the tower to take back control of guns. They're not shooting at me. Don't see shit. Oh, okay. They're all in front of me. Okay. You won't. 
got him. Kick him ass. an episode we don't like to go on too long do we ladies and gentlemen out help me okay here we go seems like this this SMG's got more accuracy than that assault rifle it's nice oh, I just can't get that son of a bitch oh come on try this again Fiddly actually to kill. Oh my arm nearly ram out. Okay, this is not good. I need a weapon. I'll do. Give me those frag grenades. What we got here? Same gun, just different sights. We're going in the building down the street. Going through. Oh shit! Pull that one around, guys. It's a dead end, Ethan. I can get us over that wall, sir. This way, Lieutenant.
Oh shit. Alright, ladies and gentlemen, we will pause it there and we'll call that episode one. I'm I'm really enjoying it, guys. I'm really enjoying it. I'm sorry I've been quiet for a lot of it. I've just been concentrating and there's been a lot of cutscenes, but I love that. I love the fact there's a lot of cutscenes. So I hope you enjoyed it, guys. Um thank you very much for watching. And I will see you on the next one. So cheers.